गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स होप यू आर हैप्पी एंड हेल्दी एट होम बट गेट बोर्ड ड्यू टू लॉन्ग स्टे एट होम सो टू रिफ्रेश यूर माइंड टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अ न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज चैप्टर नंबर टू एंड द नेम ऑफ दिस चैप्टर इज टीशूज You might be heard this word tissues in your previous classes. Then what is tissue? First, we will discuss who, what is the uh, what is the study of tissues. So the branch of science, branch of science. which deals with the study of tissues is known as histology histology histo means group of cells and logy means to study of so to to study of group of uh, the group of cells is known as histology now group of cells means tissues now the father of histology is bichat b i c h a t bichat his working period was 1771 to 1802 this is not the year of birth and year of death this is the working period of this scientist every scientist name if added the year it means it is the working period of that scientist so father of histology is mr bichat 1771 to 1772 now what is tissues a group of cells to perform any particular function is known as a tissue the various various groups of cells are formed because of the division of labor now what is division of labor students in villages the initial stage of schools are open with a, in a tin shed in which all the students and all the teachers are sitting in a single common hall and all the classes are running in the single tin shed but when the school develops the classrooms are separated 
and the classes are and the teachers and the staff is also separated such separation is known as division of labor likewise in biology also in tissues also or in cells also in initial stages the unicellular organism cellular organism like amoeba in amoeba there is single cell where all the activities like digestion respiration respiration excretion all these things takes place within the single cell but when the organism develops and it becomes multicellular multicellular the various activities are performed by various organs like bone cells form a skeleton blood cells carry oxygen likewise respiratory system for respiration digestive system for digestion so such works division by different parts the division of different work works to different systems of the body parts is known as division of labor labor 